Alright, this is New Hampshire Cross Country Powered by Runners Alley Marathon Sports coming at you from the 2024 Bobcat Invitational. Today's varsity race was brought to you by Lincoln Kuna Orthodontics. We are here with race winner who may have finished in the 20s last year from Londonderry. Introduce yourself. My name is Carson Fitzgerald and I'm a junior. Junior, just a junior. So Carson, we were just chatting. Last year you finished 20 something you couldn't quite remember. Did you think about winning this thing today? Not at all. I knew I had my sights set on top five, definitely, but I had no whatever to win at all. So, so you must have had a good summer of training. Yeah. Did you stay local in New Hampshire? Did you go any place special? I just stayed local in New Hampshire. And just put in the miles? Yep. And look how it's paying. It's paying off dividends. Paying off, yeah. Did you, you run track and indoor track in all three seasons? or? Uh, I did I did do just cross country, but I'm going to, I'll probably do both this year. Just, uh, okay, so Carson, you know that, that makes you a one season stud. Yeah. Okay, so Carson, congratulations. So you, we were talking in the team interview because your team happened to win too. Awesome, congrats. Your plan going in was to hang back. When did you, when did you, and you were hanging back pretty well. I mean, you were, I don't know, third or fourth in the first loop and then yeah. all of a sudden you weren't even winning going into the third loop and then you come around the corner, London Derry's winning. Yeah. Fitzgerald's winning. When did you make that pass? If you I were? knew, I knew the second lap, it was just time to go, time to hustle. And then the third lap came, I was, Top three, right, right with my team, uh, teammate Josh Toomey, and I knew I just had to, I could have my sight sets on first place, just about five meters ahead, and I knew I just had to attack him on that downhill right before that big up. So it was a downhill? Yeah. On the downhill, and then you didn't feel him come back, you, you felt like you had it going yeah. up? Yeah. All right, that's awesome, and, and um, that was a, a pretty decent time. What was your biggest challenge? Did you have doubts at all, or did you just keep an open mind the whole time? Like, I can I, win this thing, or? I felt pretty good the whole race. I didn't really, I know I trusted the process of going out a little conservative, and just I knew I had to really pick off those second and last laps, so. Awesome, awesome. So next week, you have Nashua North. Yeah. You think you might have a little different sort of challenge that week, or a little different approach? I mean, definitely way different course, a lot more flat, so. Definitely going out a little bit harder, maybe not trying to be so much conservative, try to get a good spot and just go for a good place, good time. So you didn't do indoor and outdoor track last year. Did you play other sports? I did not do anything in the winter, and then I played lacrosse. Lacrosse, but, okay. So you got speed. Yeah. All right, so that might actually translate to a National North course right there. Yeah. All right, cool. All right, what about uh, your favorite favorite apple? I know we said that, or favorite fall tradition you pick. Uh, my favorite apple is the Granny Smith, and fall tradition is probably just Halloween, trick-or-treating. Trick-or-treating, yeah. let's go. And then what about shout-outs? Uh, I'd like to shout-out my parents just for pushing me through cross-country all these years, and my coaches, and just trusting the training. Well, we're looking forward to seeing when, where you can take this and, and your team. Your team mm -hmm. did awesome. Yeah. So congratulations, Carson, 2024 Bobcat Invitational Champ. Thank you.